your Storm Tracker Team forecast with Danielle Giuliano. It was yet another hot and steamy day out there. Live look outside right now from our tower camera. A little bit of cloud cover continuing through the night. Temperature in the lower 90s. Seasonal for this time of year, 93 degrees. But our feel like temperature still sits in the triple digits. And it's almost 615. And it feels like 102 degrees outside. Winds out of the southwest at 8 miles per hour. Let's take a look at southeast Louisiana. These are our actual temperatures outside right now. 93 degrees here in Baton Rouge. 91 in Hammond. 93 in New Orleans. But let's switch that over to our feel-like temperature. Notice how the map got a little pinker? Yes, Baton Rouge feels like 102. Gonzales feels like 109 out there. 104 in New Orleans. So again, most of us still sitting. Thibodeau, 110 degrees. Still sitting in the triple digits for our feel-like temperatures throughout this evening. And it's going to be hot and steamy. That's exactly why we still have that heat advisory in effect for at least another 45 minutes here until 7 p.m. That's because feel like temperatures are climbing above 108 degrees. That is our criteria for a heat advisory. Your feel like temperature has to be 108 degrees or above, or an actual temperature of 103 degrees or above. So, with that, heat safety tips stay hydrated, stay in the air conditioning at all costs. If you do work outside, make sure to do it in the early morning. Take frequent breaks. Wear light colored clothing and most importantly, look before you lock. And that goes for the whole rest of summer here until you head into those cooler months. Live Doppler radar, a lot of that shower activity we've been seeing, it's stayed further off to our east, closer to Mississippi and the Mobile area. We've stayed majority dry throughout the rest of today and into tomorrow. But as we head through hour by hour, you head into tomorrow morning. Showers and storms starting to make their way in. Isolated and few and far between, but you are going to see some showers accumulating throughout the morning and into the afternoon. This is 3 p.m. here, still some of them, mostly down by the New Orleans area, some of the stronger cells. But again, few isolated showers and storms expected as you head throughout your Sunday. Then you head into early Monday. We're going to increase that daily rain chance as we head through the next few days. So heat advisor in effect until 7 p.m. this evening. Daily storm chances do return. And we have no end in sight for this very repetitive, hot summertime pattern here in southeast Louisiana. 77 degrees tonight for your overnight low. Partly cloudy out there. Mild and muggy winds out of the west at 5 miles per hour. And the main things you need to know over the next three days, very similar to what we've been talking about for like the last two weeks here in southeast Louisiana, stifling heat, afternoon storms, and practice heat safety. That is a big one. Over the next three days, those temperatures will be sitting in the mid-90s, around our seasonal average for this time of year. Storm chances will increase Wednesday and Thursday. Those temperatures drop just a little bit, 92, 91 degrees. And then you head into the later part of the week, and that's when you start to see those temperatures really stay the same. But Wednesday and Thursday... As a weak system starts to move through, it's going to increase our rain chances. And then we'll go back to those daily afternoon showers and storm chances as you head into Friday and Saturday. So lo and behold, as we start tomorrow and head into the work week, make sure you keep that umbrella handy. And remember, you can always catch us on the radio. We have partnered up with iHeartRadio Baton Rouge for your weather on the go. That's it. So if you're walking a dog outside, keep an eye on that dog. Yeah, keep an eye on the dog. Keep an eye. You know, it's always a good test is to mm -hmm. put your hand on the pavement and see. If you can't keep your hand on the pavement, your yeah. dog's paws most likely can't be on it either. So just keep that in mind, too. Exactly. Yeah. I didn't know. Thank you very much. Okay. Good advice. All right, Miss Chessa. It's an exciting <laughs> time of year. One of your favorites, yes. I know. You yeah. already know. I always <laughs> say this. It's like Christmas, but I mean, what other way do you ex do you describe it? I mean, it's football season. It's Christmas time. So we're going to talk a little LSU football. LSU's first.